Hello guys, good morning and uh, welcome back to my channel. Today's video guys is all about uh, kayak uh, motors. What we have here is the water snake, 12 volts, 24 pounds. A few of my friends are using water snake, so I was thinking to give it a try. So guys, stay tuned. I will uh, walk you through, through the whole process. But uh, meanwhile, we have to unpack this one. And also I'll show you all the things that we needed for this modifications. These are some of the things that we need for our uh, motor upgrade. Terminals, shrink wrap, electrical tape, line splitter, hand sew, male and female connector, inline fuse with 20 amper fuse, set of uh, screwdrivers, and uh, we need a lighter also guys. And also the tape measure and last but not the least this um, original hobby cassette So guys, uh, this is the board of our uh, kayak motor and uh, just a reminder guys, uh, that's why I have to focus on this video here because uh, for, those, for those who are not very familiar with the connectors like I do, I have to, have to take a clear photos or videos before making changes with the connection here. So guys, uh, finally we finish our project for today. This is our final output guys. You can go up and down and we have the lock here. And this is our power cable. This is the inline fuse with the 20 amper. This one goes to positive and uh, negative of the battery. Once we are in the water, we'll just um, plug this one, and once we're out, we'll just remove it. So that's it, guys, and uh, hopefully this one will work. Guys, uh, once again, um, if you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe, and uh, you can also hit the notification bell. 
for our uh, future fishing videos guys and uh, lastly guys all the equipments that I have here I posted in the description down below so you So guys, after a day, I made a few changes in our uh, motor setup. Now we have a speed controller, guys. It's very useful for our trolling fishing. And uh, all the wires are under our kayak now. In except this, we have to find uh, a way to put it inside our kayak. So with the battery, it's all inside the kayak. We put a horizontal rail here on the side of our kayak, which is very useful as well. It holds our speed controller as well as our fish finder here. Plus we have enough leg room here. Highly recommended guys. So that's one. That is all guys. See you in our next episode. Dumpil, uh, Ricardo, and uh, all our friends in uh, Pinoy Kayak Group. Thank you so much, guys. That's all for now, and have a nice weekend to all of you. Bye for now.